Well, today marks one year since the start of the war in Ukraine. WTOC is checking in with a Ukrainian living in Savannah who is making it her mission to help her home country. Our Flynn Snyder brings us an update on her work. Well, over the past year, Savannah Supports Ukraine has been working to collect aid at this warehouse. The group's leader, a Ukrainian native, says despite the devastation, she's still determined to help. So this is uh, 1,200 cases of different types of medical supplies. Boxes of donations sit stacked in this Chatham County warehouse bound for Ukraine. Native Uliana Gonzalez says the country is damaged, but not deterred. The year of war united the nation and united Ukrainians within the country and abroad. That united front extends here to the coastal empire, where Gonzalez and her group, Savannah Supports Ukraine, have been working since the war's earliest days to collect donations for those on the front lines. We first introduced you to Gonzalez a year ago. Since then, her group has been able to ship three 40-foot-long containers filled with local donations and money to Ukraine. We were able to help to purchase a rescue vehicle for military doctors that would take wounded out of the field quickly and deliver them to the hospitals. And I believe by that time it uh, saved multiple lives. The group has done it with assistance from company American Moving and Storage, which has helped prepare and transport donations. Even though it feels like such a small part of what's going on, to be able to see the efforts that we're doing here actually get to the front line with soldiers and you can't put it into words. The messages of gratitude from Ukrainians keep Gonzalez and her group going even during the war's darkest days. Family, friends have been already killed by Russians at the front lines and they volunteer to go and protect their land. And much like the people in her home country, Gonzalez remains determined to continue the fight for help even as she reflects on one year of war. If there is one goal and people are standing behind it together, uh, united, we can make anything happen. The group plans on sending its next shipment of supplies to Ukraine on March 4th. Reporting in Savannah, Flint Snyder, WTOC News.